Hi everybody, PJ here and today I'm going to do something a little bit different. It's only going to be a short video this one and it's something that's a little bit different. As you can possibly tell I'm at home at the moment and I want to talk about something that uh, will benefit a lot of uh, ex forces people. Uh, you know, whether you're uh, Army, Navy, Air Force, whatever, whatever force you were in, if you're a veteran, this may be of use to you. Now, we all know what a blue light card is. It's a card that's, until recently, as far as I know, <laughs> is issued to people that are uh, medics, nurses, um, ambulance drivers, paramedics, etc, 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 so that they can get certain discounts in shops and things like this. And there's a lot of shops that offer um, discounts to uh, blue light card holders. Now, uh, I was talking with some friends at the uh, Veterans Breakfast Club, uh, not this Saturday, but the Saturday before, and they told me that they got a, a blue light card so they could claim discount in various places and uh, I said how have you managed to get one of those and they said well it applies to people in the army and to veterans as well which I didn't know about so <laughs> I applied uh, and guess what I've got a blue light card now so oh there we go somebody texting me so um I can now receive uh, discounts in various places, various shops and things like that, which is absolutely brilliant. There you go, somebody texting me again. So if you're ex-forcers, um, seriously have a look at, um, seriously have a look at getting a blue light card. Uh, it will help you. A lot of places give anywhere between 10 and 20% discount to anyone that carries one. I mean, I know my local uh, Chinese takeaway, they give a 10% discount to anyone that has a blue light card. So, you know, <laughs> as you know, Chinese food can be quite expensive. So uh, I can save 10% if I have a Chinese takeaway. Now, one of the problems you may have in getting a, a blue light card is if, like me, you've been out of the forces for many, many years and uh, don't have any proof of service, then you can apply to, and I'm going to read this off my computer, the Army Personnel Centre Support Division Welfare Disclosures. Um, I will put that address and the details in, a, uh, in writing, in print, or whatever you want, below this video, so that if you do want to apply, you can uh, get from the Army Personnel Centre proof of service uh, and then you have to send that off along with your application for your blue light card. Applying for the blue light card is quite simple. Um, the other thing as well is uh, if you want to apply for the uh, discount card, the Forces discount card, Veterans discount card, you will need this information from the Army Personnel Centre as well. So I have both. I have the uh, the Veterans card and I have the Blue Light card. Anyway, <laughs> I know I've babbled on a little bit, but that's me, I babble. Anyway, um, I hope you found this useful. Uh, if you do apply for the Blue Light card or the discount card, please let me know. I, I'd like to know that I have helped somebody along the way to... Uh, you know, get a bit of discount and uh, just leave a comment below and uh, let me know if you're going to apply or if you've applied or if you've actually already got a card. Anyway, that's about it for this video, only a short one I know. Uh, if you've enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up, please share, please subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Get that card sent for if you've not got one.